forest fires broke out all over Russia. The most difficult situation is in Caucasia, over 60,000 hectares of taiga caught fire there. In the Ust Abakan region, the steppe fire spread to a pig farm and a vegetable store. Over 430 natural fires were recorded in the Krasnoy Arsk territory in three days. According to Maxim Klimkin, deputy head of the fire extinguishing service for the Krasnoy Arsk territory, the fire destroyed the village of Kubekovo. The fire destroyed all residential buildings and outbuildings. The total fire area is 9,000 square meters. As a result of the fire, the grass caught fire. At the moment, the fire has reached a fire of a regional scale. A fire rank cannot be assigned due to the fact that it is constantly intensifying. There is a constant threat to settlements. Earlier, the head of the Ministry of Natural Resources of Russia Alexander Kozlov said that 18 regions of the country are threatened by forest fires to a greater extent than the rest. The tense situation in the Transbaikal territory. The snow had already melted there, and experts recorded the first fires. In turn, in Karelia, they announced a lack of money to fight fires, since all of the funds were spent on preparations for the invasion of Ukraine. According to the forecast of the Ministry of Natural Resources, additional funding is needed to create a reserve and launch a control system, but given the global sanctions against Russia, the matter is close to default. Moreover, there are no resources for extinguishing fires such as equipment and people at all. We are close to a catastrophe of historical proportions, said Alexander Kozlov, head of the Russian Ministry of Natural Resources. The prospects are horrendous, Russia can become ashes on the planet. A special fire control regime has been introduced in 18 departments. State of emergency introduced in 15 regions. The fire victims hated the authorities, but no one has the courage to speak out on camera, since now any criticism of the authorities is subject to criminal liability for up to 15 years in prison. That's just how it may not become the main world aggressor and threat to humanity in the 21st century. Matches are not toys for Russian bears.